this is a sp elite book 840 laptop and this is the third generation laptop and this laptop problem is power is not turning on press the power button not responding here okay let's plug in the charger Power is not working. Okay, today I'll fix this laptop. Let's start. Turn off. This is the laptop motherboard. Open the RAM, DDR4 RGB RAM, and this one our SSD drive, besides slot SSD drive. Okay. Open it. Before you do anything, and you need to be open the laptop battery. This is the most important part. Let's see this. Where is the problem? This is the power sector. I need to work for that. This one is our power connector, and this is the power set. Okay, here is so many MOSFET and inductance. And keep the power. Um, this one is the power connector. Press the power button. Power button is not working, but charging light is enabled here. But power is not working. Okay. Here is some common voltage, it needs to be present here. Okay. And this pin, this point should be present 3.3 volt and 3.25 voltage, it's okay okay and here is a one cap slam and here should be present 5 volt this inductor output and that bolt is also okay but let's check this power but power is not working and let's check this some capacitor and short circuit or not and here is a very simple way to find the short circuit and you just hold this positive lead in the ground position and hold this ground lead on your hand and you just check this all the capacitor and this one is the ground pin and this one is the positive pin when you will get the any short capacitor and that will give the value of the opposite both set okay this set and this set also this one is okay this one also okay this problem is not voltage area this problem is not voltage area because of i am getting the all voltage i am getting the 3.3 volt and 5 voltage is okay but i need find some processing area and other side and here is any short circuit or not caps short or not okay and this one also okay yep but that is beeping and here is zero point Sixteen ohm. This one the ground, and this one here is showing fifteen ohms. That means that is okay. This capacitor also okay. Here is no short. That is okay. No problem. Let's see this area. No short circuit. This is the 
this area. And take this area. Here is any short set or not. Keep this guitar in the ground position. Okay. No short circuit here. That is okay. Yep. Here is a swing shot on capacitor. And let's take this again. Yeah. This one. This capacitor is swing shot. Okay. And this one also. But I want to check this first. And here is one e spot on this capacitor. Yes, this capacitor is short. Short. That is absolutely right. Keep the power and like the charger. Charger LED is glow and power LED also glow. Okay, bears, our circuit is ready. Press the power switch, turn off, and press again. Press again, turn on. Plug in the charger. Charging LED clone and this is the power LED, power LED also clone. Okay, you can see here. Okay, bears, our circuit is ready and check the display. What happened? Okay, bear, our display is broken, but display is working. Motherboard is okay. I at least we can say that motherboard is completely fine. There is no problem. Okay. Thanks for watching. I will change this display. Display is broken. I will change the display. After that, it will be everything is fine.